Hi Libra, the Empress. Happy Mother's Day, baby. We're going to do a May 15th update for you. This is a treat for everyone. This is a short video for you guys. I know I uploaded yesterday, but here we go again. So this is for Libra, the Empress, Justice to Scales, the fucking boss. Just period. What's up, baby? Happy Mother's Day to my Scales and Justice Karma, baby. What's up? Let's see. If you would like the extended version of your videos, go follow me on my OnlyFans. The link will be in the description box, comment section, and community tab. I'm doing a 50% off promotion till the 19th of May for the first 100 subscribers. So make sure to take advantage of that. All right? You'll get downloads, the extended ver uh, versions of your videos there, channeling, me dancing, doing poetry, music, just more me. It's going to be like a diary for me, and you guys have access to it. So make sure to go support your girl there. For those of you who have, I want to thank you so much much for just add. some of you are such riders man to the death no matter what I do and I love that shit thank you so much I'm so appreciative of it so happy mother's day to my fucking empresses okay give me one for Libra the empress May 15th moon rising in the north node what is this for Libra the empress May 15th for the empress what's coming in for the empress May 15th there we go. We have soulmate, similar friendship, romantic partner, and plug. Tuned in, internet, and connected. So this, yeah, threatened and insatiable and lost, drastic cut off and karmic. So I do feel like there's a karmic that could be watching you. They're threatened by you. They're watching you. They see you. They feel like they were cut off because of you. I feel like, yeah, want, yeah somebody is obsessed with you. Or this is you. Okay, somebody feels cut off or thrown to the side because of you. Somebody can know about you. All right, is what I'm hearing. What is this for the Empress? Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in the North Node. For my Empress, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in the North Node. For my Libra, the Empress. What is this coming in May 15th? Soulmate, similar friendship, romantic partner. What is this? Yeah, it says pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Okay. So, um, um, let's see, in playfulness, to, to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. And then true love, uh, separation and reconciliation, you deserve love, and this could be the one. So, you could be reconciling with someone here. Let's see what this is, Libra. It says playfulness, okay? To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine, okay? And it's so good, but we have pay attention to the red flags, all right. Oh, why am I doing this again? I already got that one. It's this one. So let's see for the Empress. Libra, the Empress. Let's see what this is. Let's clarify this for the Empress. You are the scales justice. You always get special treatment. Okay, Empress. Happy Mother's Day. We have this for all my mothers and fathers. Every day is Mother's Day. What is this for the Empress? Libra, sun, moon, rising in the North Node for Libra, May 15th. Sun, moon, rising in the North Node for Libra. What is this soulmate? Pay attention to the red flags for, for the Empress. I have this deck in reverse. Damn. Okay. We have the High Priestess. So listen to your intuition. Yeah, that's too many. We're going to take the top one. So this is listening to your intuition here. The initials BJ could be significant. All right. But um, I'm also getting something about a blowjob. So that you want to give someone or that wants to give one to you? I don't know. Okay, that's too much. All right, let's see. I'm trying. I can't. Yeah, the Ace of Cups. Okay, so this is the um, letter M can be significant as well. The initials BJM or MJB or whatever. So we have, um, so it says, so your intuition here about love, okay? Something you need, what's to pay attention to the red? Yeah, the con something's going to be confirmed or you're going to get some kind of confirmation here. What is this pay attention to the uh, red flags? What is this pay attention to the red flags for Libra? Pay attention to the red flags. What is this? Yeah, the five of swords. That's what I'm getting. I don't, I don't really feel like, yeah, the two of cups. I don't really feel like um, this is anything other than somebody is playing mind games or someone that is jealous of something. Yeah, the death card. It could be a Scorpio. Yeah, the five. Yeah, can't. Okay, so this is a cancer somewhere. This, this, this is this threatened right here. This karmic that we see. Someone is someone that hates you. They're jealous of you, jealous of you being in love with someone. I feel like this has nothing to do with you and your connection because you have a soulmate connection here. Someone outside of this, maybe somebody that got left behind or something like that. Yeah, I see you reconnecting with someone. It could be a Sagittarius Libra. 
somebody that you're on a break from or not talking to, there's a cancer somewhere with the moon card that's very jealous and threatened by you. With threatened, embarrassed in appearances, they're threatened or maybe you wouldn't feel, yeah, confirmation, that horn beeping loud like that. Yeah, or maybe somebody feels like you embarrass them or maybe they feel threatened by you. They, they're they racist, they have, so it says pay attention to the red flags here because somebody's grimy. Yeah, the death card, okay, what else? Yeah, the emperor, this could be an Aries, yeah, the world, or a boss, or a father, or a husband, or whatever this is for you. Y'all know the emperor means a lot of different things, so whatever it is for you, this is over, it's closed out, it's dead, and it's done, or this Aries closed out a situation with a cancer, or dead it, or you did. So I feel like this is somebody that hates you, that's attacking you, Libra. Pay attention to the red flags and what they're doing. Just pay attention, or this, this is this person that's got left, there, that's coming towards you, this person they left is watching you. They know about you somehow i don't know if they told them about you or what but this looks real stupid yeah so tell me more about what's going on here yeah the higher font the eight of pentacles and the ten of pentacles the ace of wands with the knight of cups what's this for the empress libra yeah the eight of wands something is progressing quickly i feel like someone's telling you they love you they're reconciling with you or something like that all right or somebody um or something I feel like there's just jealousy and hate. Someone like with these cards here, this this is not looking good. Yeah, tuned in, internet and connected. So someone's definitely watching you on the internet. Or this is you. They're threatened by you. Your beauty, you are the empress. Your strength, yeah, insatiable, unquenchable, wanting more and future day. Yeah, they, somebody has an insatiable desire to watch you, to stalk you, to hate, to be to 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 be jealous or whatever. Yeah, daily hustle, pretending and denial. Okay, because I feel like lost, ghosted, and cut off, drastic, extreme, harsh, cut off. So somebody, yeah, someone's single. So somebody, yeah, karma. Someone's mad, and they and they and they feel like you know somebody that you got chosen over them, or or this is you. You pick what side of this you're on. Yeah, the devil. I feel like somebody's obsessed with you. Okay, or this is a boss. Somebody doing things hateful towards you, or something like that. So I feel like this could definitely be a boss or somebody attacking you here, doing something to you. Who, who's reading? We got cancer. Yeah, we're cancer. I feel like there's a... So if there's something going on here, Libra, this is, I, I don't know if you're doing something in, in new or you're in love with something new that you're doing, you're progressing, you're growing. I feel like there's is a, a boss, somebody that's in a position over you. This could be a, a, the CEO, the boss, or a father, a husband, or a corporation entity with the higher font that, we keep, that keeps showing up that is attacking you. Heavily here, they're attacking you. I also feel like there's a cancer somewhere because honestly, guys, y'all know what I've been going through with YouTube for months now, attacking me, doing shit. I've lost three, 400 subscribers. They took away 400 of my, of my subscribers. I was almost at 106,000. They took away like 400, constantly attacking me, not, not, um, not, you know, um, monetizing my videos and just doing fucked up shit to me, attacking me. But I know that's going to come back heavy on them. It's not going to stop me or keep me from moving forward. And not, neither should it you. Okay. And if you're not dealing with that situation like that, you could be dealing with anything. Okay. And a relate or somebody that wants to control you that you're leaving behind a husband, a wife. <clears throat> yeah. You see how my throat went like that? Somebody doesn't want me to speak. I'm going to speak on it, bitch. These motherfuckers is grimy, nasty, dirty, and low down. What is this coming in? But I'm getting, yeah, the tower. Exactly. Scorpio energy. The tower is here in the chariot of cancer. Something is blowing up or over with this cancer or this cancer, this boss. They're obsessed with you. They hate you. They're racist. They're red face or redneck. They're watching you and they're motherfucking um, doing things, taking away your subscribers, taking away um, all kinds of shit. Somebody wants to see you just fall and you're not. Even if you don't do what you do on this place, but you're not giving up, you're going to continue to do it elsewhere. It's your destiny. So I see, in, in other words, somebody here is motherfucking get, being left here, a cancer. Somebody's breaking up with a cancer. It could be a Scorpio or Scorpio's breaking up with a cancer or cancer's doing this or Capricorn Aries and they're coming towards you. Just period. Or this is you. What's the eight of wands? Yeah, I told you. You're going to get justice in a situation. Just period. Ace of wands and a new creative endeavor or whatever. Yeah, the nine of cups, ace of wands. And I mean, nine of cups, six of swords and the will of fortune. Something is your destiny. You're going to have it by any means. The Nine of Cups is the promise card. The universe, this is your destiny, your birthright with the Wheel of Fortune. And you're going to have it no matter what. Someone's mad. Yeah, they know They know it too. Nine of Swords. 
I'm also getting somebody wants to come towards you, but they're nervous or they have anxiety about doing so, Libra. Yeah, the Nine of Wands, someone's very shook. Yeah, the Ten of Swords and yeah, the Three of Swords and the Ten of Swords. Yeah, I feel like somebody, they want to see you heartbroken or sad or asked out or broken or somebody could be nervous because they betray you, they lied. It could be a Sagittarius. Someone's on eggshells here. They're worried about karma or justice. They should be, bitch, or this legal situation that's going to go in your favor, Libra. We have the Empress. Yeah, somebody wants to see you heartbroken and sad. They 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 want to see you um, broken and sad. Or, or somebody feels like you, they want you to apologize. You're not apologizing. Suck my dick. You don't owe nobody shit. Fuck you. And that's how you feel and you stand on it. Page of Wands is your overall energy. So good news coming in. I feel like there's going to be a reconciliation. Someone's reaching out. Pay attention to the red flags because there's someone trying to infiltrate your connection or cause some kind of ending here. You know I had to go a little harder for you. Yeah, the judgment. Yeah, this is all about something that you're saying. Somebody feels offended or their feelings are hurt. Fuck you, bitch. And your feelings, ho. The fuck? So yeah, someone's gonna try to do something. Take away your 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 subscribers. Like like I said, they took away four hundred of mine. So if y'all see my subscribers going down, that's them attacking me. They um are doing just everything they can to 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 discriminate against me to do right. But I'm I'm ten toes down and very connected to source. I will get justice for every fucking thing, and I know it, and they know it too. Someone's scared, okay. And if it's not a situation where you're being bullied and attacked by your boss, racism, hate, and discrimination, prejudice, then this is a situation where somebody got left, and they're coming towards you, and their partner is watching you. This karmic or whatever the fuck this is is watching you. All right, what is this up here? Yeah, racing, running, and avoiding. Yeah, somebody, yeah, uh, Ellen. What is this up here? The, this attack right here, the devil, the emperor, and the five of swords. What is, the, what is this energy? Okay, yeah, escapade, a vacation, hideaway, and adventure. I, feel, I really feel like somebody's obsessed with you or in love with you. Yeah, I knew it. Love, the door. Somebody's in love with you, and you do not love them. You are sick of them. You wouldn't give a fuck if they died. We have love, adore, admire, and enchantment, ascension, spiritual path, and awakening, and financial support, child, alimony, and government. So somebody definitely could be trying to fuck with I see a legal situation. You're going to win in this court case with your money, whatever somebody's doing. Okay, we have ascension, love, adore, admire, enchantment, and spiritual path and awakening. You are someone is in love with you. You are undergoing an ascension. You know that you're in love with someone, or someone knows it with you. I feel like it's a karmic that's mad about it. They want to retaliate because this person left them or they're being left. Yeah, this could have happened in the past already. We have settlement, agreement, and compromise. We have pop up. Yeah. Okay, um, Scorpio got this spontaneous, unexpected surprise maybe coming in. So it could be from a Scorpio because they got that card as well. It showed up in their deck. They got it. Yeah, intervention, intervention, wish, and twin flame come together. So you are coming together here with your twin flame, Libra. Okay, not page of wands is good news. Look forward to it. Playfulness, I see you being happy or or like a lot of playful banter. Yeah, with your true love. Okay, somebody you were see. Yeah, the page of wands, king of pentacles. You're gonna good news. Yeah, someone maybe. Um, um, uh, uh, saying they're sorry with their money, giving you something, providing something for you. Wow. So beautiful energy, Empress. You deserve it. So happy Mother's Day to my Empresses. Make sure to go follow me on my OnlyFans, guys. I have some great things coming up for you guys. I'm feeling motivated and ready to fucking go. You understand? Always stay 10 toes down and keep doing what you do. I love y'all. The link will be in the description box, community tab, and um, comment section for my OnlyFans where you will get extended versions of videos and everything. I love y'all and later.